Clippers hosting the Celtics, and the Celtics are three and a half point favorites. The over under is 225 and a half. The Celtics are minus 170 on the money line, and the Clippers are plus 143. The Celtics lost the last game that they played. The Clippers won the last game that they played. The Celtics are 17 and 10 against the spread. The over is 14, 12, and 1 on the games in which they played in, and they are 10 and 4 on the road this year. The Clippers are 13 and 15 against the spread. The under is 17 and 11 in the games in which they played in, and they are 7 and 6 at home this year. And with the Clippers, as always, go and check Twitter, Underdog NBA, and see who's actually playing in this game and who they're starting because we know what players they have who tend to sit on the bench or not play because they're injured. Now, head to head, the Clippers are on a two game winning streak. The Clippers are six and four against the Celtics in their last 10. The underdog has covered their last four games. The underdog is nine and one against the spread. The underdog is eight and two on the money line. The over has hit in their last, uh, the over is eight and two in their last 10 games. The home team is five and five, and the over 225 and a half is six and four. The last game that they played, the Clippers won 91 to 82 as a six point road underdog. The game before that, the Clippers won 114, 111 as a one point home underdog. The game before that, the Celtics won 117 to 112 as a four and a half point underdog. The game before that, the Celtics won 119 to 115 as a five and a half point underdog. I just have a very strong suspicion that the casino is going to need the Clippers, and generally you want to be on the side of the casino. I'm going to take the Clippers with the money line, the Clippers getting the points. I'm going to go over in this game, and I know it's going to be strange for the Celtics to lose back-to-back -back games, but things like this happen. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.